Hey guys, welcome back to YouTube Help Tutorial. Thanks, thanks for sticking with me. So right now I'll be doing a wrong video title description or or thumbnail on Facebook and Twitter. People know about Facebook and Twitter, so I I have Facebook. So when entering a a YouTube URL to Facebook or Twitter, the 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 auto populator populated video title title description or thumbnail may occasionally occasionally be blank or out of date this can happen when a when a YouTube video is is entered into a post before the video has finished pro processing or while the video is private you may have you may have also update updated your your thumbnail or metadata on YouTube after sharing the post on on a third party website occasionally even the even after the video has finished processing and it and is made public an out of date title description or thumbnail may appear this will this will eventually this will eventually fix itself once facebook or twitter update and caches how to how to update the title or description immediately facebook you know all about facebook i know about facebook if if you're if if you're an uploader and want to ensure that other users will see the correct title and description when sharing your video on Facebook, you can you can enter the you entering the video URL in the Facebook the plug tool to immediately to immediately update the cache's cache title and description. If you run into other issues considered if you if you run into other issues Consider report the issues to Facebook, Twitter. A lot of people don't know about Twitter, and people don't know about Twitter because it's really rough on Twitter. So if you if so, just in case, I'll read it for you. If you are the uploader and want to ensure that the other users will see the correct title and description when sharing your video on title, you can you can you can enter the video URL in a in a Twitter card validator. To immediately update the cache's title and description. How to avoid these issues? When you upload a video, make sure that the video is processed, processed, made, made public, and that the people information and thumbnail are, are are set on YouTube before passing the video link on the third-party website or app. Passing the link will load the video information. At the moment, into caches, even if the title or description is changed on YouTube, the old information will persist for for anybody who pastes that URL until the caches is update. That's pretty good. So we're moving on to send YouTube debug information. So if you let YouTube know. That you're having problems playing videos, we may ask for your debug information, for or debug your debug information or stacks for nerds. This information helps us troubleshoot your issues. Debug information and stacks of nerds don't contain any person personally personality identif identifiable information that. Information they do reveal review some de details about your device and the video you you were watching. Some of the details include and some some of the details include and are not limited to devices, manufacturer models, and OS version, video ID, link to the video being played, CPN, a mostly unique random identifier for a current playback, and and band bandwidth bandwidth band with with details. So YouTube TV stack some nerds. Number one, when a video is playing, click more. Number two, in a video that appears, toggle on net on stack some nerds. Number three, go back to the go back to the video to see that stacks of nerds displayed on the player. Number and number four. Take a clear photo of the stacks of nerds to share them. To turn off to turn off stacks of nerds, go back to more. 
to toggle it off. The Stacks of Nerds features is also support while casting. Turn turn on Stacks of Nerds on your mobile de device. The instructions are below and and they appear on screen and the cast session. So for the computer, Stacks of Nerds. You know, that's why I know this. So debug information. Go to a video watch page. Right click on a on the player. Then number two, right click on the player. Then select copy bug info from the in, from the menu. And number three, to share the debug information, paste it from your computer. Simple as that. So stacks of nerds. So that's that's look that looks different. So number one, tap the tap the tap the account icon. Number two, go to settings, then tap general. Enable the stacks of nerds, staff for nerds, or tap advance. Enable stacks of nerds. Go to, number three, go to a video and play it, then tap more. Number four, tap the stack pulse icon. Number five, take a screenshot of stacks of nerds to share them. If you don't enable stacks of nerds and settings, you won't be able to see them when you tap more. So note to 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 get debug information is that for nerds must be enabled. Number one, go to a video and play it when tap more. Number two, tap the stack pulse icon. Number three, to copy the information, tap copy debug info. Number four, to share the debug information, play paste it. Paste it from your device. That's pretty simple. Mobile mobile sites. Here's the last one that I can stop there. Note that note that not all mobile web players support this features. Number one, tap to hold the player. Number two, from the menu that appear, select the stacks stacks for nerds. Number three, take a screenshot of the stacks for nerds to share them. Finally, I'll be doing so. I'll be doing a video only available. So I'll be stay tuned for video only available to YouTube Music Premium members. All right, so stay tuned for that.